All right, guys, this is just going to be a modeling video, okay? So try to enjoy your night. Have fun. It's Monday, I know, but Monday is fun too. Well, now that we're all staying home pretty much all the time, uh, it's fun to just be doing whatever you want on a Monday, trying to have a good time uh, doing whatever you do. Now, I'm not sure what you guys do. I mean, for, mo for me, I just know what I do, but I'm sure you guys do a lot of fun things, I'm sure. Uh, but yes, thank you for watching. All right. So totally enjoy the show. Now I am going to bring up Philip Solo TV. I think it's Philip Solo TV tonight. I'm going to talk a bit about that channel. Um, he's a very, I'm not even sure how long he's been around. He hasn't been around for too, too long. It's not like he's been around for, he's been around a long time with his other channel, but that was too racy and he got, he got his channel kind of had trouble with this channel, but then he put that back up. He was allowed to for some odd reason. And then he was able to have a new channel, and his new channel is kind of racy too, and YouTube hasn't done anything about it, but, but they, he's got two channels, I think, uh, one kind of hidden, the other one's not hidden, but um, he's, he's racy and stuff like that. For him, I think, I think the, his focus is shock value. He is a rapper, so I think Richard Clark was the one that suggested me talk about it, so, I mean, it's a great idea to talk about that, bring up drama and stuff like that, but... I mean, for me and him, it's, we're very different performers, right? Like, I don't consider my performing very close to what he does. I mean, in some sense, Melina and Marco were a bit racy with the Speedo videos before, but, I mean, as far as it goes now, my channel is pretty much PG, and he's kind of got a really racy channel. So, I mean, he's doing very well. He's from Winnipeg, and I mean, I've done videos. I'm, I'm in Winnipeg right now, but he's, he's in Winnipeg, and he's done... He's done a lot of racy, like really racy stuff, like nude beach stuff and stuff like that, which I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that for myself because I don't want to get in trouble with YouTube. But I mean, he he seems to be fine with it. He's a rapper, so for him, I'm sure this is not really something he cares too much about. Sure, he's not really worried about it. But I mean, as far as it goes, I wouldn't want to do those things because I wouldn't want to get in trouble with YouTube. But yes, yeah, so he's done, he's done really racy topics. He's done. Some rap, so you know, the rap stars are all like that, where they do racier things and stuff like that. But I mean, for me to compete with him, it just would be kind of we're two totally different people. But I really want to thank Richard Clark for suggesting the idea, because of course it's a great idea um, to compare yourself to someone or to compete with someone in a sense. But we're very, very different people. Sorry, <laughs> we're very, very different people. So I don't really find anything that I can talk about with him necessarily gonna be kind of like informative really or anything like that but i mean he's very very i heard one of his songs i mean i feel i'm a lot better than he is i mean but i'm kind of like that with everybody i always say that about everybody but i mean like when i compare myself i compare myself to the best celebrities whereas maybe him he would and he's good but i would compare myself to someone that's a celebrity so with millions of subscribers rather than someone with what he's got but he's doing quite well he's and he's from He's living in Winnipeg, so that's pretty good. But I'm like, well, I, I would rather compare myself to someone like I don't know Shania or or uh, or Thomas Jane. I'm not sure how Thomas Jane is doing now, but someone like Thomas Jane or even like any celebrity, I'd rather compare myself to them because I feel like I connect with them more or that I'm more related to them. But Philip Solo TV is good. His channel is very different, and his channel his look is very different too. You know. For me, when I compare people to myself, I am always using the sexiness aspect, but I mean, I could totally use the fact that he's, uh, he, his performing is a bit, I don't know, it's hard, it's hard to say, like, we're very, very different, right? Like, I'm sure you all recognize that, but it's kind of cool to bring up somebody new, you know? I'm always talking about the same celebrities and the same performers, but I mean, in reality, I want to compare myself to the top people because that's what people do when they want to get ahead, but... I mean, he's one of the top people, but I just don't find him to be... We're, we're just so different, right? Like, it's just too crazy that we're that different. But, I mean, but it's a good idea, like I said, by Richard Clark. So thank you, Richard, uh, for giving me that idea. I really appreciate it. I like when people are on my side and want me to do something to benefit me. So I'm really happy about that. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. I'm really glad to perform for you guys. I do like to perform a lot, as you probably noticed. Um, I... Oh... Give me one second, guys. 